Hey sippers, the Barb's and Nicki Minaj fan base, they are jokingly blaming Cardi B and Megan Thee Stallion for making Kamala Harris losing the election. Now, I said jokingly, even though y'all know sometimes the Barb's, they are serious. Now, it all happens because, you know, Cardi B, she went to the rally and she made her speech and she was kind of stuttering. I guess it was nerves. You know, she never made such a speech at a big, big, big rally. You know, that was like her first uh, speech at like an election rally. So, of course, she's going to be nervous. And people were like, oh, my God, Megan Thee Stallion went on stage and she was you know shaking her bum like she was dancing they were like oh my god megan and cardi b is the reason why and i'm like be for real all i can say is honey it was so funny when i realized that megan was performing one and cardi b was making her speech because I never thought Cardi B would have been invited to a rally to make a speech. You know, listen, Jennifer Lopez was okay. Beyonce was okay. But Cardi B, I was really petrified. I was like, what is she going to say? When Cardi B was making her speech, it sounded to me as if she was very unsure, uncertain about what she was saying. And people were like, you know, judging her because she was reading from her phone. And I was like, you know, that's nothing because some people, they're reading from teleprompters. So what's wrong if Cardi B is reading from her phone? That's not like a takeaway. So I don't judge Cardi B for doing that. What I would judge is that to me, Cardi B wasn't prepared, you know, she wasn't organized, her speech wasn't organized, it sounded as if, you know, she never rehearsed anything, she wasn't sure why she was there, hence why Elon Musk probably called her a puppet at the end of the day. She said she's proud of herself and she still congratulated, you know, Kamala for trying, you know, for still making an impact you know trying to make a difference though kamala never won the election at the end of the day you know as women i guess cardi b was trying to help you know to have a say but honey the barbs were making fun of cardi b and i would say nikki was allegedly trying to make fun of cardi b also because when cardi b made her speech nikki uh posted a wendy williams tweet laughing because to be honest, people were calling Cardi B illiterate, uneducated, so many derogatives. And I, I did not endorse those things. I think Cardi B is educated. I think she's beautiful. I'm never going to pull a woman down, period. Uh, for Beyonce, I was really shocked that she made her speech because I was like, Beyonce? But I'm shocked Kamala didn't won, you know, kind of shocked, but... When I saw Megan Thee Stallion performing, I, I figured that would have been a wrap. I was like, why? Megan went on stage and she danced the body yaddy yaddy and had a little mini twerk session. I was really shocked. I was like, I don't like this. This is not good. But let me know what y'all think down below in the comment section. Do not be afraid to give this video a like, share if you care, go ahead, click on that notification bell and see you guys some other time and thank you for sipping with us.